In a tech-driven world, industry's top priority is reliability. Through predictive maintenance and condition monitoring, the industry aims for unparalleled machine and system dependability. Condition monitoring involves gathering machine data like speed, temperature, pressure and vibration. These indicators expose a machine's condition. By catching wear or faults early, companies can streamline maintenance. The following training system focuses on recording and analyzing vibrations from a standard asynchronous motor. Interested? Hi, my name is Walf. I'm the product manager for electrical machines and drives here at Lukas Nulle. I'm at the moment here in front of our system for predictive maintenance and condition monitoring. Let me show you the details of the system. Here we have the drive, which is the basic for the condition monitoring system. At the system we have the sensor, which is a vibration sensor, and then we have the diagnostic unit here to get all the signals from our drive. Together with our machine test system, which is here, we can use it as a complete working drive, which is supplied by the power supply and a normal cutout switch. The system is specially developed for hands-on training. So in the focus, we have students at technical colleges and the students on vocational schools. The system can emulate the following faults, misalignment, gearbox damage, bearing damage, and unbalanced. All these faults can be measured and analyzed with our diagnostic unit. The training system is supported by a complete Labsoft course. In the Labsoft course, we will provide you all the necessary theory and guided experiments. Let me give you a short demonstration how to perform different faults with the system. Let me start with the unalignment. Here we have different accessories. So for misalignment, I need the key, an Allen key, and the gorge. Now I will start and I will open the screws here. I use the gorge, choose the correct value, which is given normally in the laps, of course. I put the gorge between the motor and the key, the, the screw, and then I fasten the screw again. So in the next step is open the button screws for the motor, and now I can move the motor from the right side to the left side. Fix the motor again. And now the system is prepared for misalignment testing. Now I will open the software for the diagnostic unit. Here I open now the spectrum analyzer. If I start the motor, I will get the FFT analyze of the complete system. Here I will see the complete spectrum and I see what happens inside the unit. Now we have here the drive with no misalignment and we see we have less harmonics than with the drive with the alignment fault. Let me show you now a second experiment. I would like to apply an unbalance on the system. We have here a special coupling with an unbalance and this will be mount on the drive. So I will remove the shaft cover, remove the motor. Now I will open the screw, remove the coupling and replace it with the unbalanced coupling. Fasten it and now we have a drive with the unbalanced. Now I will start the system again and then we have a look on the spectrum analysis of our system. So we will see here the unbalance of the system. If we're looking for failure with gearbox damages or bearing damages, we have to dismount the shaft. And before we do that, we have to remove the oil. Let me show you how easy that is working. So first I will remove our machine test system, use a special pump and a ventil. 
put it on here and here. Now I use the pump to pump the oil from the gearbox to the container. If the oil is removed, I can interchange now the shaft with the different faults. For example, we have here one fault with a tooth fault, a gear fault, or we can use a fault with a defective bearing.